Clear prop. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Grumman Pilots YouTube channel, directly supporting the Grumman Pilots Association. And this morning, we're going to talk about the canopy. It's a very important part of our airplane. It's an integral part of the structure, which is why a lot of other aircraft don't have canopies, because when this thing is latched, it completes the integrity of the airframe. So a canopy on our airplane is nice to have in the summer um, in hot climates. You can open it, let the big fan cool you. But uh, let's take a look at some of the components on the canopy that we need to concern ourselves with. Okay, so how does your canopy latch? Well, it slides forward, and then as we hook it and pull it in, we get a little bit of compression on the seal. So this latch is working fine. The handle faces forward the way it should be. If it's done backwards, it'll stand up in flight and get a little bit of drag. So that's the latching. Then we want to check the double bead seal. We want to make sure it has some life left to it. Or as the guy on YouTube would say that it has some squeezy bits left. Then we want to check to make sure that we have a canopy seal on the front of the canopy that is it installed correctly. And in this case, it is. How does the canopy slide? Nicely. Needs a little bit of cleaning and a little bit of lubrication. But for the most part, this canopy is just fine. We also have the canopy buttons, which when you go all the way back, it prevents your canopy from, it hits the rear stop uh, in the back of the uh, turtle deck. So we've got the buttons in place. As you're doing your canopy, if you take it off, then you're gonna wanna take the rails out. You're gonna wanna take the rails out that are on the canopy and swap them side to side so they wear on the other side. You also want to make sure that the tracks are nice and clean. Um, that we have a white bead seal on the inside of the canopy right here, which is where we want it, and it's proper. We come and look at the back, and we have the black seal on the back, as well as the canopy ride bumpers. There are four of these. What they do is they actually pick the canopy up when it goes to close. It gives you a nice firm seal, prevents this from rubbing on the turtle deck. So that's the turtles of those seals. And then we have the canopy ride bumpers and springs. You can just barely hear them. They are working on this canopy. So we're doing pretty good there. And believe it or not, that pretty much is a canopy inspection. You know, the final thing you want to do is you're gonna come back and look at how does the window seal in here? Is it, is it loose in there? Is the felt still holding up and everything? But that's about all there is on the canopy inspection. So we hope you found this informative. I'd like to thank you for watching Grumman Pilots YouTube channel and uh, directly supports the Grumman Pilots Association. You also want to check all the placards. Uh, you'll notice that on this particular canopy, we're missing the canopy latch cover, and there are some placards that go on the canopy latch cover, specifically where it relates to the latching pen. But you want to check all your placards on your canopy. Push to unlock. Make sure you have them all. There's one that goes on here. And also on this canopy, you'll notice that we don't have any of the canopy buttons as we saw on the other canopy. And there's no canopy rail on this one yet. So anyway, that pretty much completes up a canopy inspection. Thanks for watching, and have a good day flying your grumman.